Good morning, Americans. This is your favorite alien and Bubba <coughs> here on the morning of Friday, November 20th, 2020. TGIF. And here's an editorial on the task force, the COVID task force from yesterday, 1119, uh, with Mr. or Vice President Pence and Dr. Fauci. Well, if you notice, there was nothing said at that. Uh, and then you got the news saying yesterday, Oh, the latest from the CDC is, Stay home for Thanksgiving! Really? Is that all you gotta do? And don't forget your mask and social distancing. Well, that, like I told you before, that's back in stage one, and you're over here on stage seven, stage eight of this thing. And... Uh, then they said, oh, well, by the end of the year, we should be at 298,000 dead. Uh, yeah? Really? Would you try 400,000 by the end of the year? Look at where you are now. You're going to hit 260,000 by the end of this weekend. 260,000, people. And you just hit over 12, uh, you're going to hit over... Uh, 13 million by the end of the month. Ooh, 13 million infected. Hmm. That's over 3% of your population, people. Yeah, really? You don't get that. It seems like it doesn't sink in somebody's brain over there. It doesn't sink in your White House. It doesn't sink in your governors. It doesn't sink in your, your own brains. What is it going to take? A hammer on your head to say, Hey, you! You're putting your eggs in one basket, which is... The vaccines. Oh, it's going to be 95% effective whenever we can get it out there. And we need, uh, for one, we need 94 degrees below zero to refrigerate it. For the other one, you can put on your refrigerator. Uh, yeah. Well. And what happens if the lights go out because the people can't go to work because they got COVID-19? Oh, boy. Or we can't uh, transport it because the truck drivers are sick with COVID-19 and we don't have enough flights because our pilots are sick. yo -ho. You ever thought of that? Or how about the doctors and nurses? We boycott. We've been working too long for the last eight months. And to bring it into perspective, Americans, on July 26, you had 16 million infected and 650,000 dead. That's through seven months, January through July. As of November 26, you have over 13 million infected worldwide and over 1,500,000 dead. So that means that uh, <clears throat> at the end of the day, Okay. Uh, worldwide, let's go for that. You had 16 million back in July. You have 60 million. So, wow. It took you seven months to get to 16 million. It took you four months to get to 60. Does that tell you something? And you had 650,000 dead. Then you got 1,300,000 uh, or 400,000. <laughs> See, even Bubba says you got to do something about that. So what, what is that going to tell you in the next four months? Because the, uh, the vaccines, probably because of Trump, will not get implemented till maybe February, March or so. So where are you going to be there? You're at 60 million now. You'll be probably at 200 million infected worldwide. You'll probably be at 30 million infected here in the United States. And what do we do? Really? You had a chance to mitigate this virus and you missed it. Now your chance is the door is closing. And by the time Biden gets there, it'll be closed because you know that Mr. Trumpy Dumpy is going to dump you. He's been dumping you all the time now. He lost. I don't care about the American people. I lost. <laughs> yeah. This is your favorite alien and Bubba saying, the only ones you got to blame is you. You voted for him, and you voted against him. So you got what you sowed. You reaped what you sowed. Good day.